welcome back to my channel. Today in this video, we will learn what is Heron's formula. So, Heron's formula is used to find the area of a triangle. We all know the area of triangle is half into base into height. This is the area of a triangle. But according to Heron's formula, the area of triangle is under root s multiplied by s minus a multiplied by s minus b multiplied by s minus c. This is the area of triangle. So, this is known as the Heron's formula. And to find the area of triangle, we have to use this formula, not this one. Here, in this formula, s is the semi-perimeter, semi-perimeter, and A, B and C, these are the sides. These are the sides of the triangle. So, for finding any area of triangle, you have to use this formula. And for finding semi-perimeter, there is also one formula which is A plus B plus C upon 2. To find semi-perimeter, we have to use this formula. When you have to give, uh, you have given the value of perimeter. So, if you have the perimeter, so to find semi-perimeter, you have to simply divide the given perimeter by 2. But, if you don't have perimeter and you have given A, B and C, so you have to add A, B and C and divide the sum by 2. So, that you will get semi-perimeter. Now, we will take a simple example. Here, they have given that find the area of a triangle, two sides of which are 18 centimeter and 2 centimeter. Means, A is 18 centimeter and B is 10 centimeter and the perimeter is 42 centimeter. We will write here the values A is equals to 18 centimeter, B is equals to 10 centimeter, we don't know the value of C and the perimeter is given which is 42 centimeter. Okay. Now, how we will find the value of C? We know that the sum of all sides is equals to the perimeter. So, what we will do? We will add A plus B plus C is equals to perimeter. Here, we will just simply put up the values. What we will do here? We will, the value of A is 18 plus 10 plus C is equals to 42. So, you will get C is equals to 42 minus 28. Why 28? Because 18 plus 10 gives you 28. So, when this 28 will come in this side, it will be subtracted from 42. Now, after subtracting 42 from 28, you will get 14 centimeter. This is the value of C. Now, we got the value of C also. Okay. Now, we have to find the semi-perimeter. So, how we will find the semi-perimeter? Semi-perimeter is equals to the perimeter divided by 2. We learnt that if the perimeter is given, you have to simply divide it by 2 for finding the semi-perimeter. So, you will get 42 divided by 2 that is 21 centimeter. So, the semi-perimeter is 21 centimeter. Now, what we will do? Now, we will find the area. So, area of triangle is equals to, we know the formula under root s multiplied by s minus a multiplied by s minus b multiplied by s minus c. So, this is the formula. So, in this formula, we will simply put up the values is equals to under root s that is 21 multiplied by 21 minus a. What is the value of a? That is 18 multiplied by 21 minus 10 
मल्टीप्लाइड बाय ट्वेंटी वन माइनस फोर्टीन ओके तो आफ्टर सॉल्विंग दिस यू विल गेट अंडर रूट ट्वेंटी वन मल्टीप्लाइड बाय ट्वेंटी वन माइनस एटीन दैट इज थ्री मल्टीप्लाइड बाय ट्वेंटी वन माइनस टेन दैट इज इलेवन मल्टीप्लाइड बाय ट्वेंटी वन माइनस फोर्टीन दैट इज सेवन अगेन हियर वी विल फैक्टराइज इट हाउ ट्वेंटी वन कैन बी रिटर्न ट्वेंटी वन कैन बी रिटर्न एज सेवन मल्टीप्लाइड बाय थ्री देन वंस मोर टाइम मल्टीप्लाइड बाय थ्री मल्टीप्लाइड बाय इलेवन मल्टीप्लाइड बाय सेवन हियर यू विल ऑब्जर्व दैट यू विल गेट हियर इज इक्वल्स टू अंडर रूट सेवन स्क्वेर मल्टीप्लाइड बाय थ्री स्क्वेर मल्टीप्लाइड बाय इलेवन सो वी विल जस्ट टेक आउट सेवन एंड थ्री out of the root because these are the square symbols so how we will do that 7 multiplied by 3 under root 11 you will get this uh, this way so the answer is 21 under root 11 cm square so this is the area of the triangle in this video we learnt what is heron's formula so to learn such concepts please subscribe my channel and don't forget to like and share my video thank you